Hey guys, it's Will from Coaster Dad. I want you to meet a friend of mine. Carl is my friend. We've done a lot of technical stuff together. We're pals. We've worked together. Carl's a crazy inventor. We've doing a project together, but mostly I just want you to meet Carl. This is Carl's shop here in the, uh, the deepity deep south. And I wanted to start with one thing, Carl. I want you to show me the cabinet of life. Oh, the cabinet of life. <laughs> Hey, what do you need? Uh, perhaps a brass fitting. Oh, okay. Uh, small okay. gears are sometimes needed. Small gears, sometimes needed. Oh, yeah, there's, there's a few in here. I've been trying to think of a way to uh, make make the wheels on my roller coasters work a little bit better, a little bit smoother, more fluidly. Uh, this is your drawer. Oh, this is mine? Okay. And all your bearings. Actually, there's three drawers of bearings, so we can really, uh, okay. you know, experiment with that. Okay, now what is, tell me the story of this cabinet, because this isn't just a cabinet. Tell me, this, tell me the story of the cabinet of life. When I was 14 years old, living with my rocket scientist father, and right. he actually went to a Martin sale, which sells all the old Martin technology. And he bought some adding machines, he right. bought some digital counters, he bought all this stuff. Me and him, this is one of our first big projects together. We built all these drawers and set it all up and then loaded them, and it has been my friend my whole life. It's the cabinet of life. It, it has is. everything. Just look at this machine screws, self tap screws, hose clamps, hooks, hangers, hardware, wall fasteners, wood screws, you nails. <laughs> <laughs> all right. This place has everything. All right, you want to see? Let's see some more of Carl's stuff. So you got to forgive the mess. Please forgive it. We're in a but, very big. Yeah, project. we got a lot going on here, but there's, and I just can't wait to introduce you to Carl anymore. We can't clean up before we have you over. So <laughs> the Carburite machine, which is a, a, a 3D router, which I have modified 300% to fit my needs. All right. And that makes. All of this type of stuff you see on the wall, these are all my leftovers, didn't quite make it to production items. All right. But I love them. <laughs> okay. Awesome. Uh, Look, these are all little things that we're making. This is for Proto Palette, which yeah, is one of the... We're these for the Proto Palette right now. Okay, take me into the another part of the all of adventure. This contains a tiny little laser cutter. All right. Cut little on that. Laser cutter. Here's a bunch of proto pallets that we're working yes, on. In production. Nice. These uh, are for Maker Fair. Several work areas completely exploded with proto pallet yep. minutia. Right. Here's all the little different bits and pieces that we're using to put together the proto pallets for Maker Fair in New York. Hey, if you wanted to make something like uh, that was three dimensional in nature. Would that you would have a way to... Oh, okay, let's go see what that is. This is, is. Uh, just like the house I grew up in, the house of shops. <laughs> not many bedrooms, but there are plenty of workspaces. Oh, what? this would be my uh, production storage because I'm a production IT manager, so I fly around and do production work and networking for right. big shows. This is MakerBot. Nice. Yep. And then here's here's just a small amount of the things that Carl has printed that haven't quite worked out yet. And, <laughs> and then there's almost as much that has worked out. But look, we can print different things in different colors, different types of things. Here we are working on a phone case, and this is the yeah. That is the stage from which you send to the MakerBot. All right, we're gonna make a special Proto Palette phone case, glow in the dark filament. Conductive, which we haven't yet to play with. Awesome. Um, okay. You know, my collection of routers and just anything techie and digital, I gotta have it. Nice. And I gotta clean it up and organize it. Uh, been, I don't know. I don't know if I agree with that. It's been a time. All right. <laughs> okay, so that's pretty much the whole. Well, it's not the whole Carl show. It's like it's like some of the Carl show. Yeah. We're we got a little bit of. Just wanted you to meet Carl. Um, we're working on this thing called Proto Palette, which you can go to protopalette.com and take a peek at it. And I hope you do. And um, and it yep, there's there's the Proto Palette. It's a really cool way of doing things. And then 
What's going to happen after we finish up the What's going to happen after we finish up the protopilot project is Carl is going to start helping build crazy roller coaster stuff with me because he brings so incredibly much engineering talent and capability, and he's just as childish and goofy and silly as I ever was. And uh, so that's Carl. Woo -woo. All right, we'll see you guys soon. Bye. Bye. -bye.